Fernando Bellini's Two Toed Slot. Hi, I'm Amy, Senior Keeper of Primates at the Phoenix Zoo. This is a two-toed sloth. They have two claws on their front feet, so it's a little bit of a misnomer. Sloths sleep up to 18 hours a day, and they're nocturnal. So he's pretty inactive, he's pretty hard to find, but he will come out, he loves flowers, and he loves leaves. Sloths range from Central down through South America. This particular species can be found in the northern end of South America. These guys spend almost their entire lives hanging upside down, so the claws really help them hang in trees. They can actually wrap them around tree branches, and they can use them to give traction while they're climbing the trees as well. Wait, they're all sloths? The slowness actually helps them conserve energy. Their diet is just leaves and flowers, so it's very low energy. It also helps them hide from predators because the trees barely move when they're moving through them. Sloths can move very quickly if they need to, and one surprising thing about them is that they're actually incredible swimmers. They live in tropical areas where there could be flooded spots that they need to get across, and so being able to swim helps them move through those a little bit easier. most popular animals at the Phoenix Zoo, so it's been a lot of fun to work with him because we get to talk to a lot of people about him. Because he's so popular, you can see him on billboards and he's definitely all over the website. I think probably the cute face is the biggest draw. Fernando's a great animal for everyone to come here to see. He's a great representative of his wild counterparts, and understanding sloths here at the zoo can help people understand the importance of conserving their natural territories. Fernando's actually a really fun animal to work with. I typically work with primates, so he's a nice forced slowdown from the joy that the primates are always bouncing around with. So I really enjoyed being able to spend some time with him and slow down a little bit. For any keeper, it's definitely more than just a job. We connect with all of our animals, but Fern's been a lot of fun because it is so slow and we do have to spend a lot of time just kind of making sure that everything's okay since he does move a little bit more slowly. So I definitely feel a connection with Fern. Now you know Fernando, he's one of many cute animals of Arizona, and you can find him at the Phoenix Zoo. I think everyone's favorite fact is that he only poops once a week, so it's a little bit like um, a lottery, like an Easter egg hunt when we come in in the morning. We're not sure what we're going to find.